welcome to February 4th, which means it's the 29th episode of my Vloguary Daily Vlog Challenge that has now turned into more of a every other day challenge. I just wrapped up a full day's worth of interviews. I don't know if I'm allowed to say it. With uh, a international news outlet that is doing a story on our organization. I am done for the day. I'm heading home. It is late, late, late in the afternoon. A beautiful, cold though, but beautiful. Oh, and look, the giant bus behind me. So let's do the intro, shall we? Okay, so it is actually a day after I shot that opener that you just saw before the uh, opening titles and stuff. And so I am I was on the fence. Do I just scrap that opening because the date's wrong now and make a new opening for today? Or do I just keep that opening because I kind of like the way it rolled out with the bus coming in behind me and we'll just keep this as one episode across two days? And so that's where I landed. So right now you can see with this lovely orange glare, it is the end of the day. It is Wednesday now. And uh, I just got home. It was a very long but productive day. And I wanted to use this moment right now to briefly touch on something that came up in conversation at work today. And it is the, someone actually said to me, they said, you know, I kind of worry about you. You are always so busy. You're always working so hard. And I just kind of worry that, are you, you know, if you're going to be okay working this hard all the time. And I guess that kind of took me aback because for me, I'm doing great as far as I'm concerned. And I, and it's not, I, I say, well, you know, I don't, I, I want you to make sure you understand that you see me always busy and working crazy hours and doing stuff because I like it. Um, I made a promise myself when I was very young that, well, not very young, not, you know, wasn't in diapers, but when I was a younger version of me before starting a career, I promised myself that. I would always be checking in with myself that what I do for a living is something that I enjoy doing, um, which I know is hard and rare to find. Um, but I, I didn't want to be hating life Monday through Friday and being stressed and not getting anything other than a paycheck for what I did. And there's a trade off there because what I do for a living doesn't pay much financially. But I very much love what I do. I get a lot of payment uh, emotionally. Now, that's not to say that the work I do does not have stress. There are deadlines. There are things to do. There are people counting on me. If I didn't work hard and work a lot, they would replace me with somebody else who did. Uh, it, but the thing is, the, 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 the little click, the little switch there is I like what I do. I might even say that many times I love what I do. So for me, putting in the long hours, putting in the heavy work, being on top of things and just constantly go, 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 go. There's a reward there beyond just the paycheck. And I think that makes a big difference. Uh, and it kind of ties into, you know, I, I mentioned a couple of videos back about, you know, someone saying to me, wow, how, what do you do to be successful? And a lot of it is believing in yourself and trusting yourself and being honest with yourself, being true to who you are. Uh, but the other part of it too, is when you're, and I, I, and of course it, it matters on how you, what are you measuring success by? What is, what is that? You know, um, what's your measuring stick? But for me too, I guess I find success in what I do because I enjoy it so much. It's fun for me. So instead of going, Oh, I better do this so I can get to the next level or, Oh, I can get more paycheck for me. It's just, you know, Ooh, uh, well, what else can I do with this? It's fun, you know? And, and so I think there's an element there that allows my passion to drive me so much on its own that, uh, success follows through. So yeah, so that's what, what I want to mention is that, uh, yes, I work a lot. I love what I do. I love my family too. And I enjoy spending time with them. Don't get me wrong. Um, there's times where I purposely put everything down to just try to focus on time with my family. That's very important. Um, thankfully they understand my passion. They support my passion. I've never felt that I've been forced to choose. I, I do know sometimes I'm like, oh, I'd rather just go ahead and unplug right now and be with the family. But I try to strike that balance, and and I, I hope I'm doing that right. Um, nobody's perfect. I know I've made mistakes on things like that before in the past. That's for sure. But uh, yeah, I think I think that's what I'm getting at. Is that conversation today kind of made me think? You know, I guess from the outside it could look like I'm always working and always just busy, busy, busy. But it is a work of passion. It, it, I think if I wasn't getting paid to do this for a living, I was doing something else as a living. I'd be probably doing this on the side as a as a, a passion project, as a hobby. So. You know, it all works out.
Okay, that's it. I'm going to done rambling. I got a bunch of emails to catch up on, even though I'm technically done with work. I still have to work a little bit this evening, and I'm going to get this posted too so I can stay up with my vloguary, which is now what we're pushing into a couple days into February. Now, what is it, the 5th already, right? Today's the 5th, so i got a couple more episodes to go. We'll probably take this vlog to this weekend to finish it up, so we'll see what happens because I'm shooting for 31 episodes. All right, everybody. I hope you have a good one. I'll see you next time. Thank <laughs> you.